hello guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to do a full face of fenty beauty since fenty beauty has launched on the crossbody store on nika i wanted to do um a full face for you because i wanted to help you pick out what you should buy and what you shouldn't cuz now that they're available to us we just want it all right but you don't really need it all okay you know what i'm just like not loving my short hair anymore I'm just not. I'm a long hair girly. I figured it out. I wanted to cut my hair once more to see whether I would be a short hair girly. Even though I look good, I just don't feel like myself, you know. And also, it's at a awkward length where I don't know what to do with it. Look at me. I don't even know how to style my hair anymore. I just crimped my hair and it's not looking good. It's super frizzy for some reason and hello baby hair. Now, I don't have any skin prep stuff from them, so I'm just going to use my usual Kiehl's Ultra Facial. My gosh, my throat is just like not it. It's been like karash since yesterday and Abby is also teething heavily. So when her bottom two teeth came out, she was like we didn't even come to know when she got her lower tooth or teeth. It just popped out and she had no signs of teething whatsoever, but her upper tooth, there's one gigantic tooth coming out, only one of it and it has cracked cuz I can feel it, but dude, she had a miserable night yesterday. It was really really bad. Like she was in so much pain. There's honestly nothing you can do apart from giving them the teether comforting them and just giving them calpol calpol has been a savior but it's not good to give it every time it's a paracetamol so unless they're in like really bad pain uh, i don't give her paracetamol so rest has been good thank you for loving her vlogs you guys are obsessed with her and a lot of you are like well mal's who abby is the new thing and i'm like acha acha <laughs> but she is her smile is so infectious and she's just such a doll absolutely a dream to be around and she's just so much fun anyway now that my skin is prepped we're going to move on to the foundation now i have two products here okay the first one is the fenty ease drop this is the blurring skin tint in number 13 and this is not my shade okay so i have tried it and it's really good so in case you want to buy it yes but look at this they sent me an absolutely wrong shade it's like fully yellow so um for foundation i'm going to just use this one this is their fenty beauty pro filter soft matte longwear foundation and i um i have tried this and gone through a bottle of it cuz it was so good it has like that soft matte effect and uh, this is in the shade 260 okay that is the shade just in case you're wondering 260 has a yellow undertone undertone why did i say undertone so yeah all i did was one pump and it pretty much took care of my face but i'm just going to go in with half a pump more just to get the tinier areas of my face i'm going to take my beauty sponge and just is a pretty good foundation you know it's just like um again like i said it's soft matte so it's like that blurring really soft glow to the face it's not luminizing so i think great for um oily skin types in case you guys want to get this foundation it's a great foundation it has coverage and it just settles very nicely into the skin like i have nothing bad to say about this just figuring out your shade is going to be a task because dude they have every undertone under the sun so it's kind of a, it's a good thing but it's also very confusing to figure out your shade so make sure you are like shade matching well or finding an influencer that is close to your shade and then just like buying that i was just filming today and yeah there was a lot of applying of makeup so i think my skin has gone through it today but that's okay you know i always think like i rather a beauty creator than a fashion like i can i could never do like fashion videos dedicatedly i don't know how fashion influencers do it and they feel the same way about beauty they're like i don't know how you put makeup every single day and i'm like that's like the best thing for concealer i'm taking the fenty beauty wear even 260n it's the same shade um this n n means neutral I hope this is my shade and let's go for it. It is exactly my shade. I'm going in for my LASIK appointment you guys. Long overdue and all of my friends have done it. It's just me and I waited for the time where I was really fed up of my glasses and the time has come where I can no longer bear to wear lenses. The first thing I do when I wake up in the morning is look for my glasses. Look for my glasses cuz I cannot see. I have a very high number. 4.75 and it's just a lot to take in and I just got my test done a few weeks ago I was just trying to find a date to go in for the LASIK but there are some precautions like don't wear your lenses 7 days prior today's the last day of me wearing lenses and then I'm off lenses for 6 days and then I go in for my LASIK and then just like healing I hope everything goes well you guys I'm terrified of anything doctory even though I gave birth which is like the ultimate I'm just like terrified of aankh aankhein hai yaar aise karenge uff. I'm just I got recommended the contour 
Pura LASIK, just in case you guys are wondering. I will let you know how that goes, okay? I will try vlogging it, but if not, I'll let you know generally how the LASIK went and what are the side effects if I got any. I'm really terrified of the dry eyes scene happening. I don't know. By the way, great concealer. It's not dry, it's like hydrating, it's light, it's like really good coverage. Um, of course, I could use a shade lighter, but it's like exactly my skin tone. It's awesome. I don't have the setting powder, so I'm taking the uh, Prism Libre by Givenchy and setting my eyes really quickly. I cannot get enough of this loose powder. I think it's one of the best loose powder to ever exist. I keep saying this in every single video, but it is the truth. I got this cute handheld mirror look from H&M. Look, sticker cute out there, dude. This is cute though. It's really cute. Okay, I'm gonna do my brows really quickly. Don't have a brow product by Fenty. Gonna use the Benefit brow product. This is the Precisely My Brow. Ah, uh, so excited. I love the Benefit products. I keep speaking about them. Okay, you guys, while I'm doing my brows, we have to talk. We have to talk. We have to talk. Okay, uh, just like a bunch of shows and stuff. Like, we need to catch up on it. Okay, so one day. One day has just had my heart. I don't know if I spoke to you guys about this in my last video. But you guys, one day has totally made me cry. I was like, she went an entire life, they went an entire, like, lifetime almost not loving each other. Like, they loved each other, but they just, like, their egos kept them apart because they just didn't want to confess that they loved each other. I just don't know, dude. It's just, like, heartbreaking that they could have had all their lives together, you know? That just broke my heart because we all knew they loved each other since the beginning. They were just, like, waiting for the other person to say it. You know, the, the time they sleep together and for the first time? And then when in the morning when she turns to him and she's like, Adam, if you muck me around, I swear to God. And he just looks at her with such conviction and he's like, I don't know what he says. He's just like, I would never. I just bawl, dude. I'm just like, no. Because his eyes had such conviction. Like, you knew he would never, like, mess around with her. And I was just like, this is the greatest love story, bro. Like, I don't know, notebook and all. Baju me gaya, dude. This was like, I was like in the feels, you know. But yeah, I was feeling it, dude. I was feeling it. Anyway. So great show, one day on Netflix. And then I watched this very weird movie. It's a new movie called Spaceman. Um, Adam Sandler is in it, but I don't... Weirdly enough, I was hooked on to it. There's this guy who is married and has a baby along the way. And he just like leaves to go to space for like six months. And this is fictional, okay? I hope, yeah. You know, and how he goes through his days over there. It's a very weird story, bro. If, if I give it away, I don't think... Actually, watch it. Because the next line I'm about to say is going to give away everything. So they show his inner thoughts and him having a battle in that six month journey and all his fears come to life and why he is the way he is. And I don't know, man, it was just really, really like a weird movie, but it was so like hot. It was just like it warmed my heart watching that movie because I sort of understood. It's like whatever you take from the movie, you know, whatever your perspective is. And uh, it's just a great movie. Just in case you guys are wondering what to binge watch, I think these are great. I'm just watching podcasts. I'm just like weirdly obsessed with podcasts. I just cannot get enough of listening to different people. If you want to know what I'm listening to and what my next podcast is, what I learned from it, you have to join me on my newsletter. Like I speak about everything on my newsletter. So please, please subscribe to my newsletter. I'll leave a link down below. And I really like have a heart to heart. Like I write a letter to you every Sunday. You get it in your email box and it's the best thing. I felt so close to you guys. I'm going to use this beautifulness here. This is the Fenty Beauty How Many Carrots Diamond Bomb. The shade is called How Many Carrots diamondy like beautiful i don't know how to explain it it's just like crystal look at this wow can you see it's just like a wash of shimmer so i just want to put that on my eye just as is for that soft shimmer oh wow that is beautiful it's like a speckle of like starbursts it's so pretty so nice you can build it up you know you can build the intensity which is great how much ever you want i would just like go all over my eye like right up until my brow i love remember my like shoulder glows you guys i used to love them i still do i'm never without my shoulder glows and body glitter i just love look at that so this is a really nice product to put on your chest and stuff we have a fenty beauty mascara this is the fenty beauty hella thick mascara looks really good actually with this like diamondy effect wow i actually really like it that is so pretty look it's really nice, especially with this eyeshadow. It looks really good. I haven't even curled my lashes. I didn't curl it. I really like it. It definitely is going in my drawer. Oh, what's happening? Okay. Best friend. Cough sills. 
please don't mind my chewing even if you do i have to get through this video and go to abby so we don't have time right now <laughs> we have to rush 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 this is the fenty beauty cheeks out cream bronzer in the shade teddy so i bought this just last month from the us bronzer just changes everything it just looks so much more defined with bronzer okay that looks awesome i look really tan dude i watched damsel i loved the movie it was a little creepy not gonna lie but i loved her and how she looked i love that she had a full face of like kajal and lip gloss in the dungeon like that was so realistic i just love the glam even though she's battered and bruised she has that lip gloss that's shining through and i'm just like that's it that's that's the lip gloss we want 24 7 we'll just stay on our lip she just looked fantastic in it it's a very uh fantasy movie it's a very time pass when you have time watch it kind of a movie next is this liner it's brown in color this is the fenty beauty long wear liquid eyeliner in in big truffle i didn't want any liner on this yeah it looks so pretty as is that's very warm for my liking quite stunning i must say both the liners are starkly different because i haven't done a liner in so long <laughs> but let's just like it looks pretty i like this liner better it's like straighter Oh, it's so starkly different. I don't even know how to correct it. So I'm just gonna leave it. We have this Fenty Cream Bronzer. This is in Petal Popping uh, 02. That is a very beautiful coral color. I think cream blushes are great. I think this is a great one. Simple application, not overly pigmented. It's really beautiful on the skin. It's glossy, it's luminous, and it just looks really nice all in all. Um, we're, like literally, we're basically done, you guys. Like This is the fastest beauty video ever. This is the Fenty Velvet Liquid Lipstick um, and this is in the shade HBIC and then I have MVP which is that red lipstick so let's try both. We have two reds. Why though? Okay. <gasps> Went on my beige curtain. Now my beige curtain has red stains like it's blood or something. That's pretty. I'm gonna line my lips using Swiss Beauty Bold Matte Lip Liner in the shade Fruit Punch. What is this? Why is it so gunky? Oh, I think the applicator came out from inside. Now it's clean. Wow, that is stunning. Wow, you guys, that is beautiful. That's a lovely, lovely red. It looks very dry, but it's really not dry at all. It's like a very nice, comfortable formulation. It look, It's so matte, but it's not a liquid lips. You know what I mean? It's a, it's a velvet soft cover lipstick it fully transferable okay so let's try the other lip i'm very excited okay i'm trying the shade mvp now mvp seems like a more cherry red like a more brighter red as compared to the other one wow you guys have to see this oh wow this formulation This formulation is turning me on. <laughs> like absolutely, I would hold every one of their nudes if they had a nude collection. Oh my God, I'm gonna check if they have like a nude worth buying because my nudes are very specific. Wow, if you're into reds, are you kidding me? You have found your red. MVP. That one was also okay, but this one is like stunner. This is like, you know, the French girls, they wear this like red undertone. This is a blue red, I think. Red on my curtains, red on my hands. It's like red everywhere. Um, all in all, super great. They have a contour stick. I forgot to try. Okay, I forgot to try their contour stick. Why can't I just, I'm just gonna try it on top of this. If you're into cream contours, if you think, you know, you really want it, then why not? I mean, blends really well. Yeah, there you go this is the shade mocha 03 sorry for not using it i absolutely missed it i'm gonna take this diamond dust thing and just put it on my cheek just because like i said it's like speckles of dust like diamond dust everywhere look at that it's like smudged i smudged my red i'm coming down with something you guys okay and fenty also has their gloss bomb i love the gloss bombs i have bought two myself because I love it. This one is in the shade Fenty Glow Gloss Bomb. This is a more coral shade. Um, but their gloss bombs are fantastic. I highly recommend their gloss bombs. 
I definitely think all of the products were great. It really depends on what you're looking for, what your budget is, and do you really want that product? Because honestly, the cream bronzer, cream blushes, you get dime a dozen for cheaper rates. So I'm just saying like in comparison to what you really need from Fenty that's a standout, the lip product. I've been wearing this lipstick for about 20, 25 minutes now, and I just wanted to show you the transfer. It's intense. Though the pigment doesn't come off of your lips, it doesn't. It still stays. It's very red and it's intact, which I like, but I don't like this. Like every time I'm just like sitting like that and I'll get like red on my. And it's also transferred on top, which is a very messy lipstick. It's a very messy lipstick. <laughs> I love the mascara and I love the diamond dust. It's a different product. So these things are different that you can try. The foundation was brilliant. Um, so yeah, everything was great. So it really depends what you want to spoil yourself with. I'm going to rest up now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video helped you a little bit in understanding what you can get from Fenty. Um, let's see. I will keep an eye out. I will probably pick up some products myself. Let me know what you loved and what you slightly like leaning towards getting. Let me know down below. I love you and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.